Hey, what's going on, everybody? Good morning. Good morning. I have a I have a word of inspiration and motivation for you. And actually, I have a question for you. It's a question that I thought about, a question that everybody should think about. And um, it's it's something that's really important. It's about your life. And my question to you is, who's speaking life into you? That's right. I said, who's speaking life into you? And the reason I ask that is because Everybody needs a good coach. And I know this because not only have I been coached, I've been an athlete, but I am a coach. Good morning. Good morning to everybody coming in. Good morning. So my question to you is, is who's speaking life into you? That's right. I mean, see, it's like this. A good coach improves your game, but a great coach improves your life. That's in Proverbs 31 and 10. I mean, 31 and 30. A good coach improves your game, but a great coach improves your life. And that's what I want to do. I strive every day and to figure out how I can help improve someone's life, how I can help someone go to the next level, how I can help someone believe in themselves. How can I motivate someone to understand who they are and how to walk in their purpose? Because it's all about a good coach. And I go, I can go all the way back to when I was in grammar school, where it started when I was, I was eight years old. My first coach was my cousin, Melvin Gunn. He taught me the importance of hard work. He taught me the importance of teamwork. And he taught me the importance of being a leader. I got my first trophy when I was eight years old and I was playing basketball with the 13 year olds. Was I discouraged because I was the smallest? Was I discouraged was I, because I was too little? No, because I was encouraged and I was pushed by my coach to understand that I brought something to the team, to understand that I had worth and value and that it was necessary. So what I want to do, I would be honored to be your coach. I would be honored to, to feed and pour into you greatness, to feed and pour into you motivation, to feed and pour into you inspiration to push you to be your best because I don't think you've even scratched the surface of who you are yet. Why? Because you have to really understand what you're capable of. And you you also have to know that trials will come. There will be tests, but understand this. There's no testimony without a test. There is no testimony without a test. There's no victory and triumph without failure. Sometimes you have to fail to see just how to get it right. Failure is just a setback. It's meaning that if you lose, it's a setback. It's a setback for your comeback. And, and, and when you understand that and you know that, you will be successful and you will be prosperous. So I'm telling you right now, the true job of a coach is to pour greatness into you and change your life. It's not just about winning the game. It's not just about getting MVP. It's not just about how many points you can score, how many goals you can make or whatever. It's about changing lives. When you can change lives and you can help people to understand who they are and whose they are and that they can grow and walk in their purpose and achieve their dreams, that's the job of a true coach. And that's what I strive to be. And I want to be there for you anytime you need me. You guys can subscribe to the YouTube channel, Simeon Henderson, uh, like the Facebook page and continue to support. And we're going to do this together. So my question to you is simple. Who's speaking life into you? And a good coach not only improves your game, but a, a true coach, a good coach, improves your life. Be symbolic, simply your best, because being deeply rooted stimulates growth. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. And I would be honored, honored to be your coach and speak life into your situation and everything you do. Go get it. Stay committed.